Good morning. Good morning. Good Veterans Day, yes. everyone. I want to give a shout out to all, everyone who has served or is currently serving. A special shout out to my niece, Alice, who uh, is serving. That's right, yeah. So a special shout out to them. I'm Dr. Robin. This is Russ. Together we're the founders of Whole Food Muscle and offer the book, How to Feed a Human the Whole Food Muscle Way, which is over there. Someday I'm actually going to remember to put the book here in the, before we start in the morning. I'm not going to grab it. The book. <laughs> He's not listening well, to me. Well, I just noticed that uh, Facebook has changed their... Um, their interface? Yes, a little bit. So oh, it, it, it threw you off. Yes. You got distracted. I'm very easily distracted. It's true. So anyway, today I wanted to talk to you about burning mouth syndrome. Um, we have had a few people recently... Hey, Sandra. Good, good morning, morning, Sandra. Who... Um, you know, we, we say all the time, doesn't matter what you're eating, don't care what diet you're on, you should take a B12 supplement. We say it all the time. All the time. And there are people who don't listen to us. They choose... <laughs> Which I personally don't understand. Well, <laughs> they, they decide that for them, B12 supplements are necessary. They don't need them, whatever. Right. And then they end up with symptoms... For all, for all these, you know, whatever, they go, they spend all this time with their doctor and they find out they're B12 deficient and then they're like, oh, I should have been taking a B12 supplement. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because by the time you're deficient, it really takes a long time to get it back and up. And you have some kind of complication as a result of it. So um, recently I was having a conversation with a dentist and I learned something new that I hadn't heard about, about um, B12, being B12 deficient and deficient of, of some other minerals too but, uh, and vitamins, but generally B12. And it's called burning mouth syndrome. And basically, um, your whole inside of your mouth, your throat, your tongue, everything turns really red and becomes super hypersensitive to heat. And when I say heat, I mean anything spicy and anything that's like super coffee. Um, the person who um, I was talking to with the dentist was having a symptom of having to drink their coffee lukewarm because it hurt their mouth so badly to uh, to drink coffee and this person's uh tongue actually had fissures in it uh, from being um from from burning mouth syndrome and so it, it, it is one way that ha being b12 deficient can manifest is that you have this uh hot burning sensation in your mouth and it can if left untreated can c cause neuropathy which is damage to the nerves which means it doesn't go away you end up with it permanently um, and, you know, being B12 deficient can make you feel tired. Uh, that's kind of the, one of the first symptoms that shows up is being tired. It can also um, manifest as other things. Shaky. Yeah, you can know you're, you're, yeah. you're getting shaky. I had one person I saw um, ended up being tested for cancer because their doctor couldn't figure out what was going on, tested them for cancer. So seriously, people, take your B12 supplement. They're cheap. They're easy. You can't overdose on them. Right. Um, and as Robin said... Regardless of what type of diet you eat, because how we used to get our vitamin B12 was by eating generally animal products because they ate the soil. Or we which, ate soil ourselves. Or we ate because we weren't cleaning our vegetables as much as we are, or our food in or general, water. or water. So we were getting it because it basically comes from dirt. That's it what it comes get. from. So B12, your body makes from a bacteria. Right. And that bacteria comes from soil. Right. But, but since we live in such a clean society where we have hand sanitizers everywhere we look. You know, and, and we're constantly cleaning everything. We're taking the B12 out. We're, we're that, that, the um, bite bacteria. The bacteria out of our, our normal system or mm -hmm. processes. So and, and animals don't, like, magically get it. They get it from soil as well. And so if animals aren't grazing, they're not getting it either. And um, my brother, who's a large animal vet, says that a lot of animals are supplemented with B12 because they don't get the bacteria either. So if you're not getting enough B12, it's going to be a problem. Brenda, take B12, people. Yes, exactly, yes, right? Exactly. I, I don't like supplements either, but it's super important. And so if you have unexplained mouth pain, it could be, and I'm not saying it is, but it could be that you have um, a low uh, B, B12 deficiency. Mm -hmm. So just take it. It's super simple. Once you get a deficiency, you're going to need to get uh, shots right. to get it back up because it's not something you don't want to sit in a, a deficient space. And so the person that um, um, I was talking to over the weekend who has burning mouth syndrome, taking su the supplement um, and, oh, I learned something else interesting. The ones that dissolve in your mouth, which are, you know, what do they call them? Sublingual. 
Sublingual, thank you. Couldn't think of the word, sublingual. The reason that you shouldn't swallow when you have them in your mouth is once the B12 hits your stomach acid, it kills it and you can't use it anymore. Right. Heidi was all low B12 even when I was eating animal products. Yeah, right. it's just, exactly. there's, it's, that's the thing. You, sh you absolutely need to be taking it. So if you, if you are having, you know, basically just take it. You don't even have to have symptoms. Mm -hmm. But if you are having issues with your mouth that are unexplained, it could be that, um, Good that morning, you're Yolanda. low B12. Hey, Yolanda. And so cracked tongue, sore mouth, sensitivity to hot, shaking. Black I mean, feet, we've even heard of. You, so you could, do, you could do research on it and find symptoms, but don't bother. Just take a B12 right. supplement. It is, it is like Rob said, it's very inexpensive. Um, we get ours from Costco and we get like 300 capsules, you know, tablet. Ta sublingual, sublingual tablets. Sublingual tablets. Thank you. But yeah, uh, put them under your tongue and then don't swallow. I know it's easy to think about just chewing it, get it done and swallow it. If you do that, you lose the benefit. You right. have to let it absorb uh, into your system through your uh, tissues in your mouth so that your body has access and, to and it. And Robin just recently got her blood work done and her B12 is perfect. My B12 is fine. We right. take it twice. Let me, I'll even show it to you. Yeah, we, we take do. it twice a week. It's 2,500 uh, micrograms. Yep, 20, 2,500 micrograms. And the one that we... Um, that the person is taking twice a day is 5,000 right. uh, micrograms because she's you know, deficient. deficient. Right. But 2,500 micrograms, we take it twice a week. Um, we don't take it with coffee just because it's not a good idea to take vitamins with coffee. Yes. The, the, the caffeine. caffeine and stuff right. can do weird things to your absorption. So just don't take it with, with, with caffeine. But sublingual, super easy. And it's funny, they used to taste good to me because they do have a, uh, a fake sugar in them. Now I can tell that they're fake sugar, but you know what? Yeah. I take them anyway. They don't taste bitter, not like, ah. No, they're know. not bad. They just taste no. a little funny. And they dissolve relatively quickly. So. Yeah, they're pretty quick. So get your B12 supplement. Take it. It's good for you. There are all kinds of things that can go wrong if you're not taking it, and it's just really not worth it. So please believe me. It's so <laughs> frustrating to me. Hey, Deborah. Good morning, When Deborah. someone comes up to me and says, oh, you know, I read your book and I saw that you said take a B12 supplement, but I didn't do it. And now I'm, don't be deficient. Right. Just, just do it. it. Just it's, do I it. I mean, of all the things that I tell people to just do, this is the simplest. Right. Like things like, oh, but I don't like vegetables or I don't want to drink water or whatever. This is super easy. Yeah. So burning mouth syndrome caused by uh, being low on your, on your B12. Um, it could be other things too, but most typically B12. So, um, Chastity said good morning. She did it's say popping good up morning. here sooner than it, it is, is over there. It is there. That's nice. So, that's what we wanted to tell you today on Veterans Day. Right. That is our public service announcement for today. Take your B12 supplement, it's important. Exactly. So, with that, we'll say eat real food, mostly, mostly plants. plants. Have a great Have day. Have a good guys. one. We'll see you tomorrow.